Hey, good morning, Seattle Baptist Church. Thanks for watching the day-by-day -day, uh, devotional this morning. It's Friday, ready for the weekend, and I'm excited for what the Lord's going to do in our church this Sunday. And I'm just really glad that I can uh, have another video with you today. And I'm outside of my front yard this morning next to these flowers that I had no idea they were here a couple of months ago. But now that it's spring, they're blossoming and blooming and they're beautiful. And I enjoy seeing them uh, outside every day, whether I'm out in the front yard or looking out my window. And it's a wonderful time about this season as all the trees are, are growing, uh, leaves and flowers are coming out of the ground and uh, there's just life in it and I really enjoy that and you know that's what I want to talk about today was seasons you know there's there's something about every season that I believe we can be grateful for uh, you know obviously spring with all of the the life and the trees and uh, a little bit longer days and sunshine uh, but summertime is uh, coming up as well and every time it's summer I just think about the 4th of July and uh, the, the patriotism that comes with that and the long days and uh, the warm weather and uh, I think about camping and going to the water and I just I love summertime uh, and then I think about the fall and in the fall the, the color of the trees and the leaves and them falling to the ground and uh, the harvest fields the, the harvest moon uh, pumpkin spice latte from Starbucks amen for that uh, I love the fall time and then, of course, uh, winter comes, and yes, winter is dark, it's cold, but it's Christmas during winter, and I, I really enjoy the Christmas music and the lights and the trees lit up and uh, the time around family and celebrating our Savior's birth. Uh, and then, of course, New Year's always rolls in, and it's just a wonderful time of year. And just every season, there's just something that you can appreciate and I want, to, I want to read to us Ecclesiastes chapter 3, verse number 1, where Solomon said this. He said, To everything there is a season and a time to every purpose under the heaven. You know, I believe the seasons work together uh, in harmony. I believe they work one with another. Uh, we wouldn't be able to have these trees and plants coming to life if we wouldn't have had some spring rain, if we wouldn't have had all the snow in the winter and the rain in the winter. And then we wouldn't be able to have uh, nice green summers without the rain and the snow that we got during those seasons. And then fall, there'd be no harvest in fall unless we had the rain and unless we had the sun. And so God created it that way. That's, he's a God of order. And uh, he orders all of these things on purpose for the earth to function. And every season is essential in our lives for growth. You know, I believe right now during COVID-19 season, God is doing something in our lives. He wants to grow us. Uh, he wants to teach us. He wants to help us during this time. And I believe that there's something we can appreciate about this season. And I believe that in all of our lives, it's probably something different from one another. But God has a purpose and a time for every season. And I believe that we just trust God by faith and believe his word that we'll find something to appreciate during this season. For me, I've certainly appreciated the warm weather and the sunshine probably more than ever because if not, it would just be another spring. I'd be about my routine, but I've really appreciated it now because I'm at home a lot more now. And so I really enjoy the sun when it's out. Every season in life is vital for our growth. We need to, con we need to be able to have seasons in life to grow and continue in life. And whatever God is trying to do in your life, He wants you to continue and grow. And so during this time, uh, whatever it is God's doing in your life, I believe He's doing something in, different in all of our lives. Uh, I, I'd encourage us to find out what it is and to appreciate this season and to find something to appreciate during this season. Because God has a purpose for it. Every purpose, every season, there's a time for all of it, according to the wisest man in the Bible outside of Jesus, Solomon. So I hope you have a great weekend and get out and enjoy some fresh air and some sunshine. And we're looking forward to Sunday. Hope you can tune in for the services at 11 o'clock Sunday morning and then 6 p.m. Sunday evening. God bless you. Have a great weekend and we'll see you soon.